Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, if you hear any background noise, that's just my dogs. So um, today we're going to be ex I'm going to be explaining the ending of Godzilla minus one. Ha warning: there will be very heavy spoilers for minus one. So this is your chance to click off now. If you haven't seen minus one, go watch it, then come back later. Anyway, um, yeah, like and subscribe. So the ending of the movie shows some boats, as you know, pumping their free on gas push him down and then bring him up with the air tanks and then the air tanks sorry inflatables and the, the other boats pull him apart as you know that happened but then he died in the post credit scene near the end of the movie well it wasn't actually post credit scene but i mean it was before credit scene right at the end showed the, the g-man regenerating himself and this is similar in the ending of the ending of this movie was very similar to gmk in fact this movie had a lot of similarity to gmk um, one of the main characters was named Tachibana. Um, Godzilla in the movie was pure evil, pretty much. I mean, he was definitely pure evil in GMK. This one, debatable, but pretty much he was pure evil, mostly. Um, yeah, and the way he was died at the end, like, in GMK, he's going to shoot his atomic breath at the characters, but then it comes out of his shoulder and at the wrong part of his body instead. This is, this is basically what happened at the end of Minus One. He took... It shot out of the wrong parts of his body, and then, yeah, he died after that, after another thing happened. Cough, cough, um, kamikaze, cough, cough. Um, yeah, this is because, m the most likely reason this happened is because the director of this, Takashi Yamazaki, did say that the original film and GMK were some of his favourite Godzilla films, so yeah, that's good. Uh, what else is there? Oh, yes, Koriko, Kori Noriko, Noriko's death. Or, and revival or healing heal or whatever that she healed way too quickly and as you saw in the film all that debris hit her right in the face there's no way her face would be that clean and there is a black growth on her neck in the end of the film if that's shown that's most likely part of Godzilla so protect and that maybe had a part in her regeneration being so, or healing being so quickly potentially if there is a sequel Potentially, he could be going up against Biollante because Biollante was made from Godzilla, a plant, and a woman. We have Godzilla and the woman. We just need the plant now. So, um, yeah. Anyway, guys, now we're on to like a um, sort of comparing it with the MonsterVerse. So, like, with the GXK trailer. So, like, minus one was real. Not well, not realistic, but if. Godzilla appeared in the 1940s that's most likely what would happen because Russia and America and America no sorry the USSR the Soviet Union and the United States couldn't intervene because like Soviet like Cold War tensions and stuff and that was quite clever I think and then like the government can do anything otherwise it would like confusion with other countries so like eat they had to, like, get the, c the civilians had to do it, which was, I think, it, and it was a quite clever plan to kill him, to be honest. It was a really clever plan, like, how they did it, like, with the pressure and stuff. It was really clever. And also, that shot at the end when the Sh Shikishima is about to fly, fly the kamikaze plane into his mouth and Gojira is charging up the atomic breath. That face was just pure evil, terrifying, man. Like, that was just crazy. Like, seriously. And also, in the ending, when it showed Goji regenerating at the bottom of the ocean, like the before credit scene, that's very similar to GMK as well, because in GMK, at the end, it showed his heart um, beating down at the bottom of the ocean with the Godzilla theme. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Don't forget to like the videos. And subscribe don't forget to hit the notification bell if you want to like you can be subscribed and not get notifications but if you want them then yeah you definitely can also why not it's literally just pressing the button so anyway i hope you enjoyed today's video guys um be sure to let me know what you thought in the comments down below and um yeah i'll see you next time guys so um bye